uh, there's the uh, your your team. You opened the team in Vegas for a short while right. during the IFL days. Right. Why did you end the team so abruptly? Well, first of all, I I was I was going to move to America and and uh, and I was invited to to get a team in IFL. I was moving to America. I went there and I was invited to open up a team to get a team in IFL. Uh, I stayed in IFL for almost a year, but then the organization uh, was finished for some reason. And uh, after that, uh, my life took a different, uh, different uh, way, and uh, I gave up everything. And, and, and now I'm just uh, training as a hobby. So, okay. your last. MMA fight was uh, in cage rage against Lee Hasdell, and you won that fight by submission. Exactly. That was in 2007. Does that mean you're officially retired now? Yes, I'm officially retired. Okay. And so, what's next for uh, Mario Sperry? If well, you're not, if you're not, if you're not fighting anymore, what's what's next? Well, uh, I've been traveling a lot. Uh, I've been training here and there. Uh, whenever people ask my help, to, you know. To, to share some knowledge, uh, it's always a pleasure to, to be on the mat training and, and, and teaching, learning, still learning and, and trying to de develop new techniques, new tactics and, and pretty much is this, I'm, I'm trying to, to keep in shape, uh, I'm trying to, to be connected with the sport at some point, you know, in Abu Dhabi, in Brazil. Pretty much is that. Uh, I train whenever I have a chance. Okay, we'll wrap up with. Uh, I'm gonna give you some names. Right. And just give me like a one-word description, or just as brief as possible. Just what What do you think of the fir the first the first time uh, you hear that name? Uh, Carlos Santos. Look, uh, Carlos Santos, a lucky man. Ricardo Liborio. Strong. Fast. <laughs> Sergio Pena. Very technical, the best. Antonio Minatora Miguel. The hardest man in town. <laughs> Morello Bustamante. Very smart, intelligent, and calm. And finally, Sheikh Tahnoun bin Zayed. He's a, like a brother to me. I owe everything for him. Okay. Uh, on behalf of the Emirates uh, Jiu-Jitsu team, all the coaches, the students, we'd like to thank you for promoting the sport, you know, universally, not only in uh, in Brazil and the U.S., even here in, in in Abu Dhabi and the UAE. You know, if it weren't for people like you, uh, you know, Jiu-Jitsu wouldn't be where it is today. So, on behalf of the team, you know, we thank you very much. Thanks, thanks for giving us the interview uh, to show the people, you know, uh, to give them information about you and who you are. So. To, it's the least we can do for someone who has given so much for probably 11 years now or more. I mean, for us, it's 11 years. So for jiu-jitsu, it's all your life. So uh, thanks, and uh, hopefully we can see you again. Of course. It's a great pleasure. And whenever you need, I'm here to help. Uh, and once again, it's a great pleasure to be here. It's a great pleasure to, to chat about fighting. And uh, once again, it's an honor to be in Abu Dhabi. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, have a safe flight back wherever you go next, and uh, we'll see you soon. Thank you very much.